Donald Trump has vowed to slash federal aid for schools that push critical race theory, transgender topics, and other materials deemed unsuitable. Day one, I will sign a new executive order to cut federal funding for any school pushing critical race theory, transgender insanity, and other inappropriate racial, sexual, or political content onto the lives of our children. And I will not give one penny to any school that has a vaccine mandate or a mask mandate. And I will keep men out of women's sports. And I will fully uphold our great Second Amendment. NRA endorsed me, gave me their full endorsement. Thank you to the NRA. We will protect innocent life and we will we will restore a thing called free speech. It's being taken away from us by these radical thugs. Parental rights and control over educational content are crucial. Trump's commitment to defund schools teaching critical race theory and transgender issues aligns with widespread concerns about school indoctrination. Striving to eliminate inappropriate content reflects a desire to uphold traditional values and shield children from concepts deemed unsuitable for their age or development. The public cherishes individual freedom and often criticizes government overreach. Trump's opposition to vaccine and mask mandates in schools mirrors broad public discontent with perceived excessive governmental intrusion into personal and family choices. His pledge to protect the Second Amendment and ensure free speech highlights a conservative effort to defend constitutional rights and resist government oversteps.